Recently, I came across a documentary about Alexander Lipsch's love for aviation. What intrigued me the most was his strange aircraft designs, specifically one he called the Aerodyne. This unmanned experimental aircraft would inspire me to construct it for my final project. By far, the fuselage was the most time-consuming and difficult to make. It took many different approaches, but this was the most optimal for me. I sketched the interior of the duct using section planes and lofted each sketch to get the shape for what air flow in. I then started lofting the outer surface of the aerodyne to finally cover up the interior and using the intersect tool to fill in the cavity. For the propellers, I used airfoiltools.com to get the planes I needed. I lofted these curves, added a hub using the revolve tool, and made it onto a simple engine. The air curtains were assembled in a way that could be used to control the airflow out. Each air curtain was made to have a limited angle range to allow for varying degrees of lift. From Litchie's schematic, the landing gear was built to be simple to allow for better liftoff, so I assigned a simulation. Most landing gears are made with steel and applying an axial load on top of the strut simulates the reactions happening when landing the aerodyne. The colors and visuals were inspired by this reimagined model I saw since I didn't want to leave it black and white. It took some imagination for parts that weren't clear like the shape of this air diverter and which airfoil to use. I hope you enjoyed my project as I had a lot of fun constructing and learning all about it. My appreciation goes to Lipch's amazing aerodyne.